Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Today's video, we're going to talk about Tales of Tenorio. Now, Tales of Tenorio has been delayed. If you are not aware, we had a whole entire um, issue in a situation of um, people giving death threats, doxing, all that stuff to the developers for the game being delayed. It was supposed to come out in February 17th. And by the time I'm recording this, it is February the 19th. Update on the situation right now. This is as much as we got. He's going to be sending us teasers every time there's not a uh, the game's not releasing. He said in the news. If the news shows. There it is. And I am going to let um things speak for it. From here, these are the bugs. They did a poll the weekdays one. It's a poll right here. On um, what release um, would you prefer now? Weekdays or weekends? All of us picked weekdays. A lot of a few people we picked weekends. 400 poll. Then let's go to news. And I will let this speak for itself. Mongolian Tug Rick Utopian said diff. I'm here to explain some of the issues that we encountered before the intended release for Todd. There were three major bugs haunting us for release these were. Global indoors breakings on us, this is where stuff like Tuno stations were dealt with so blacking out would send you to the void. Idle battle camera breaking, do note this is the exact same code we've been using with every single reveal and teaser so how it broke is anybody's guess. One save corruption bug, okay this one was on me I didn't expect for certain features to be abused to this extent thank god we found it though. You may think oh wow only 3 major bugs how did they not release. Let me introduce you to why Makoto was pushed back anim saves some animators may know what these are and they, somewhat, recent changes with them effectively when these are on the client it causes significant lag and for massive ping spikes and eventually roblox kicking you out of the game. You would have thought Roblox made a dev forum post about this change and it should be easy to fix and I'll tell you oh it worked in the developer testing place but when we tested in the release place it happened. Do I know why it affects the release place but not the dev test place? No and I doubt I ever truly will. Now I will take you to release day the idle battle camera doesn't work. Okay easy fix. Oh what the entire bounding box of the model isn't correct why would that be? Could it be this? Or this? Or maybe even this? Global indoors broke and was fixed relatively easily, required a rewrite in how they worked. Save corruptions. Okay let's dedicate a few people into replicating it whilst the others test. It took hours upon hours to find the exact reason. IMG1 global indoors bug. IMG2 idle battle camera bug. IMG3 Anim saves issue, talked about before release on why Makoto had to be pushed off. IMG4 also Anim saves affecting everything that communicates with the server. Mongolian Tug Rick Utopian said diff. Plus good news is a lot of the bugs we've found during testing have been fixed and a new release will be put out very soon but only when we can say with 100% certainty that it can happen. Mongolian Tug Rick Utopian said pings a bit more info on what actually caused the delays, please do note there's a fair bit more than this but I didn't want to waste time explaining every little detail when getting this game out is my priority. Mongolian Tug Rick Utopian said the date in the fourth screenshot relates to the first appearance of the Anim Saves issue, the scale of it wasn't seen till far later when we tested in full in the release place rather than the dev place. Mongolian Tug Rick Utopian said this is why Makoto got delayed as we couldn't guarantee every area could be fixed and tested before release with every build in the game requiring an update, indoors, areas, cutscenes ECT, carrot. Lucky HD said just FYI any personal harassment I see towards any of the developers, 
i.e. threading them, making fun of physical appearances, etc. will just straight up be a insta ban. Lucky HD said general chat will be remaining open, and shouldn't be experiencing any lockdowns. A lot of people are associating the lockdowns with, they don't want to hear criticism or they are silencing us. No, the general chat was a toxic cesspool that was chaotic ASF the other day and our mods have been trying their hardest to clean up this as much as possible. All my Mongolian tug Rick Utopian said for every day the game isn't out I'll supply a leak of some kind. Well, as you probably heard, the game was delayed and then there was harassment of appearance and all that stuff. Um, and the musician for Tales of Tenorio got harassed in his DMs while he's taking times out of his day with his out of his time with his family and stuff like that to get um, his music done and all that stuff. There was a whole cesspool of toxicity like Lucky HD said in general chat, which I have seen it's been locked like what 12 or 10 times in one general chat. Because everybody just keeps just spamming like random hate. Um, but anyways, let's move that a bit aside from controversial stuff. Um, Utopia said, for every day the the game isn't out, I will supply a leak or s of some kind. This is not as bad as it sounds. It's crazy how many issues have been fixed easily because you're not deprived of sleep. Lord. So, then after that, we got a teaser. Which is this one. Who's on being level 135. And he says, let's see if everything is now patched. Uh, Tessus VAs, voice actors, devs all working together to abuse the living heck out of Tales of Tenoria. They try to figure out the, the whole entire bugs so they could patch it and then once it is all patched, we will be able to play the game. Also don't know why the bug type is right there. But yeah, basically, long story short, the game will be released on the weekday and we will eventually get there. And once it do, um, we do get there, make sure to join the live stream. I will be streaming until the game releases. Anyways, I'm going to stop the video here. Um, like if you like the video, subscribe, turn on notifications, share the video, comment when do you want the game to release. Um, and which starter are you going to pick for Tales of Tenorio? Uh, go to the description, follow all our social medias. We have Roblox outfit. Um, you can purchase them there in the Roblox group. Join our uh, Discord server, we're almost at a thousand members. Um, like 400 away or some stuff like that. Um, 300 something. And just join up in our live stream. Until I see you guys next time, stay safe and make sure you do take care of yourself.